Hi, I'm Hope, and here we are captivating a godly home inside and out through Christ Jesus. I hope you enjoy the channel. Welcome, and I hope you have a blessed day. Hey y'all, so welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are doing great. I'm doing wonderful. So I have a Walmart grocery haul here, and also um, Aldi is Instacart, and both, and both of them were deliveries. So today is Sunday, uh, January the 14th. So happy new year, y'all. Uh, you probably will see this video first. And then I have another one that I did previously this new year. So yeah, so I hope you have a great start to your new year. Um, what have I been up to? Busy? I'm out of breath because I'm just now taking my Christmas stuff down. Jason putting it up. Uh, we were sick for a little bit. And then I just didn't feel like taking it down. I just didn't feel like taking it down when it was a break, when it was winter break for the kids and for myself. Um, I just didn't feel like messing with it. I didn't. I definitely didn't want to take it down before the new year. Um, we weren't doing all those uh, traditional uh, superstitious I ain't doing that stuff no more. So, it just got down when it got down. So, I hope you guys are doing wonderful again. It's going to be a grocery meal plan, grocery haul and a meal plan. And I might show y'all some fun stuff I got from Five Below. I haven't been sharing a whole lot of stuff I get from the store lately. Um, I've really been asking a lot for a while. Um, is it... I think groceries is fine. But, um, I, don't, I was trying to see if I was just... It was condemnation or if I was convicted by the Holy Spirit. So I'm trying to see if it's just that or am I holding myself back? So I haven't even shared a whole lot this year too. Y'all want to work on my blog a whole lot. Um, push that out and y'all know I'm in school. If you're new, welcome. My name is Hope and here we talk about faith, family, and home. And um, I really want to push my blog um, this year, I decided to, which I don't probably lost my mind <laughs> doing that in school, but sign up for a mastermind again with my blogging mentor, um, what's it, uh, Kim Anderson Consulting. I'll put her information down below and she has helped me, motivated me in so many different ways. And I'm grateful for that because I see the growth, um, more so on my more so on my blog. Um, yeah, I'm seeing the growth. So anyway, yeah, I'm going to pay. I really want to work on that. So you guys will probably see some new content. I'll post on the community tab if it's a new post and try to roll these emails out. But I'm also trying to be realistic and not overdo it as well. So let's get started with this grocery haul. And what I meant by that, y'all, is that when I started my channel nine years ago, I just didn't know how to word this or explain it to you all. Um, there, We were like... Mm, we weren't struggling, but sometimes like with the groceries and stuff or whatever I was buying, um, I don't know. Our situation just have changed. So I just don't feel like, um, I should share so Hi, much. I'm so home. it just may be something here, that I need to get out of my head. We are captivating a I'm godly thinking, home you know, inside and out. My mama feels like it is. In Christ Jesus. <laughs> something in my I head. I hope you enjoy um, the maybe channel. Maybe so. so welcome. Um, that's and just I hope why you I haven't have been blessed sharing day. as much. And I didn't share our Christmas stuff and stuff like that. So our either maybe the Lord's just dealing with my heart differently. So I've just been really um, praying about that. So anyway, so this right here, y'all, is Walmart. And I decided to do Walmart because... When she was doing my Instacart um, with Aldi, it was some things that sh they did not have. So, I got some Caesar salad. They didn't have this at Aldi. I got the family size and I got the regular size. Then, they didn't have these at Aldi as well. So, I got the sandwich thins and this is the multi-grain. I got the meatloaf um, seasoning. I will cook this tomorrow. And then, I saw this when I was about to check out and it's the one pan sheet one sheet pan market farmers market chicken and vegetables and here are the, some of the ingredients if you want to see on the back so i did um watch that video you are what you eat and then i think i was it what the health or something like that years ago um <clears throat> and it did make me think about you know having more vegetables and stuff like that i don't know if i can absolutely go vegan maybe but um especially after doing the daniel fast it's a long long story about that y'all so and i had to go to the urgent care and everything 
uh, when I eliminated protein from my diet. And that may be only because I was, you know, vertical sleeve patient and stuff like that. So I don't know if I can ever want to personally or if I can totally, you know, maybe a short period of time, but not every single day. Um, and I even tried, if, if you knew or anything, I even tried eating the beans and the leafy greens and it wasn't enough, um, protein. So, sorry, y'all had something on me. So I got the sour cream because they didn't have it at Aldi. They were all out. I got some more trash bags. We like these with the max strength, max strength. And then the man, which I meant to get the smaller cans. I didn't mean to get the big cans because my big boys are not here. And so I'm having to learn how to cook less and cook. And I'm also trying to make sure that Josiah eats um, healthier too. So I think I'll talk about that in the first grocery haul. So I got two of those. Um, I did get some Tylenol because we ran slim out of this. Uh, so I wasn't feeling well the other day um well a couple weeks ago then i got some of this splash i probably shouldn't have got that because i end up getting the pure flavor water from aldi then i did get some more power wash i got some honey crisp apples now i've been folding clothes up here so um that's what this is i get them done quicker if i fold them up and put them on the counter uh let's see instead of putting them on the couch i have some salad and then um this, this apple don't look too well. Then Jason had this already in the shopping cart. The firm toothbrushes. He likes the firm toothbrushes. Uh, I don't like those at all. So, as well, the strawberries, they didn't have the smallest size. So, she got this big one. They didn't have it at Aldi. So, we're going to have to use this for, like, smoothies or something because that's a lot. Is that everything from Walmart? Um, they didn't have any Texas toast as well. So, I had to get that at Walmart. And I think that's it, y'all some bacon potatoes from Aldi this is Aldi and some shells and cheese and I usually don't get this a whole lot I used to get it you know years ago and I'll doctor this up and stuff um if I wanted some mac and cheese probably tomorrow and we really not be mac and cheese people the only person that loves 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 mac and cheese is my oldest and um you know he's on his own he's moved out on his own so I just grabbed that today um let's see but it's pretty good doctor it up i needed some sandwich bags to fill up my little organizer in my drawer and i think this this um let me show y'all uh fill up my organizer in the drawer i think aldi had these on sale this week i haven't been keeping up y'all um let's see i got some toaster tarts so likes these and i try not to get too many um because he likes to sneak um different snacks granola bars i didn't get those today either because he'll sneak them um, the California raisins, and I'm and I'm sitting up here trying to wonder why is he not hungry. So that's why I can see, and he getting good with it. That's what Jason was saying because I hope he can't hear me because we have no idea that he came down here and got a snack. Um, California raisins. Jason likes to mix this with his um, mixed nuts, and um, I got some con queso cheddar cheese um and this is for the baked potatoes so i'm gonna cook this today and then also these country style ribs um i think i cooked the recipe before i think it was about seven sisters or six sisters in the crock pot but i'm gonna put these in the oven and just cook them season them up real quick um a cabbage this is a small cabbage this may came from walmart yeah, because they didn't have any at Aldi. And I told her that's fine because usually when I get a big cabbage, depending on how I cook it, if I cook it like the fried cabbage way with bacon and stuff, they'll eat it. They'll gobble it up. But if I just cook it the regular way, <laughs> they won't gobble it up as fast. And then again, it's just Jason and I eating it. And we kind of get tired of it after a while. I got some chopped walnuts because y'all look at this. Now look at this. Aldi bananas and we had more than this. So <laughs> Jason accidentally um ordered these a couple of days ago so usually i do the ordering but sometimes he wants you know i may be busy or he wants something so last the very first time he ordered the y'all know when you order bananas you got to hit each quantity of banana you want um so he he was like oh do you do i hit each quantity and i was like yeah but he ordered the organic which is 
for each bundle. <laughs> and I didn't even realize he ordered organic. So that's why he has so many, y'all. So I'm gonna make some banana bread. I probably need to make some banana pudding, but I don't wanna um, sabotage Jason. So I make some banana bread and then I'll put it in the freezer. I know y'all, and it was more than this. Then y'all, I did get some of these garlic knots. These are really good. So you just heat these up. You put a couple of slits in the bag and they're so yummy. I got some salmon. I need to put this stuff up. I got some turkey bacon, some chicken tenders. So that's why I got those. And then I got some 80-20. I'm gonna make a meatloaf and something else. I don't remember. With that, Josiah, I asked him would he like the Frito-Lay baked chips. I didn't even know Aldi even had them, but they didn't have them today. So we had to get these. And then I got these little purified junior waters. And this is for my craft room refrigerator upstairs so i have to do a blog post and do a tour of that because i got footage in my phone and i just I ain't edited it and um so hopefully i get that out i got the spring water y'all and i love this spring water this one missing i want it fell out her car wait a minute so i love the spring water y'all and then i got side side some of these fruit waters the only thing is that the peach usually ends up sitting there jason will drink it but he, you know, is drinking water. And then, um, y'all got all these lemons. I did the same thing Jason did one day. <laughs> and I don't know how I did it. Yeah, so I need to make some lemon water. Maybe today. All right, y'all. Then I got some Capri Suns for Saya. I haven't gotten this in a while. And, oh, I should have put that up, y'all. I'm wasting it. Um, this is good. These little ciders are good from, um, you can get them at Dollar Tree. So I got these De Animal smoothies for Saya. And then I was watching a WW haul and she got these and um, I think her husband wanted them. And I always remember, forget to look at these chocolates. And I really enjoyed y'all those advent calendars this year. I was doing a 21 day fast. So I didn't get a chance to really, um, you can have what you want, but I couldn't eat until like 3 p.m. So all of December, just about. So I didn't really get to enjoy it. I still have all my coffees, some of them. Because, you know, you can't have coffee too late. And then, let's see, I got the cheese, advent calendar, the coffee, and the chocolate. So the chocolate, it wasn't the European chocolate, that green box. I'll see, I'll take a picture and put it up. I didn't like that at all. But that other advent calendar, I think it was... What kind of chocolate is that? Y'all can't even think. But it's really good. Really good. All this chocolate is good. So anyway, she picked this up as a treat. And based off the points and you scan it and stuff like that with WW, you can have a couple of pieces. Um, she also picked this up for this white cheddar. I think her husband likes it. I like cheese too. So I got that. Um, I don't know where this came from, y'all. So she told me they were all out and all the other sour cream. So maybe out of kindness of her heart, she got this light sour cream for me um, from Food Line. And I don't know how she did that, unless this is another customer's. I don't know how she did that without paying for it out of her pocket. Cause you know, I'm a Instacart shopper too. And I haven't shopped in a while, but I don't know how she did that. I think she paid out of her pocket y'all. So I may have to up her tip for that. And then I shoes, halves and pieces. Saya likes cashews, so I got those. I saw it was like a, I think this is a limited buy. And then I did get some of this Coraline, Coraline uh, multi-purpose cleaner with spray bleach. And I wasn't, this is something I wasn't gonna buy. I do have one down here for the kitchen, but I wasn't gonna buy this because I have a big thing from, <clears throat> what's it called y'all? Sam's that I still haven't used and all I have to do is refill it. And those are one of those things I just don't want to rebuy because I already have it, but it's an inconvenience to go and refill it. I know y'all oh, get real. And then I keep forgetting cause it's down here. So I went ahead and got it anyway because I needed it in my shower upstairs. But I am going to take that universal bottle and fill up that Clorox, um, I think it's Clorox cleanup or something that comes in that great big two gallon, three gallon thing. I got some flour, y'all, to make that banana bread for all them bananas. And then I did get some triple cheddar cheese just to have on hand. Um, or if Sia wants that on his baked potato. Um, I did get some honey 
wheat bread for Saya's lunch. Um, these chicken breast fillets for his lunch. No, for dinner for him one day. Um, some hamburger buns for that. Or hamburger buns for something else. I can't remember right now. Some flounder, y'all. I got some zucchini. Um, two things of that because usually it cooks down. And we eat that really quickly. Um, the Brussels sprouts, the way I cook mine, because my mom was just asking me this yesterday, I wash them off, cut them in half, saute them in the pan with onions. Um, I do have some kind of seasoning that's bacon seasoning. I use it sometimes, not all the time. I'll see if I can find it from Amazon and flash it up. And then I use the blend seasoning, sometimes some mints, blend seasoning from Kinder's, and then sometimes some minced garlic, and it's good. All right, I got some spinach, y'all, if I want to make some egg bites, some veggie burgers. Um, I haven't had this in a long time. My very first Daniel fast, um, I had these and I saw these. So I'm going to try these again. They were they were really good. They were really good because I won't hardly eat it. <laughs> and then I got some raspberries. I did get some ham, y'all, to make a sandwich. So I probably have to put, uh, it usually comes in two packs, one in the freezer. Um, my mama had watched somebody um who was it was it dorcas um which is Misha and monica monica's friend she has a youtube channel and she did an unsandwich or something so she cut everything up and mixed it up i still haven't watched the video but i was just thinking about that and then aisha cooking with aisha had some ham uh sub sandwiches she made for her kids the other day so that's why i grabbed that i hate when the grapes are super big like this but I, I wasn't there to get it. Then I got some fat-free half and half. I'm really turning into a coffee lover, y'all. So, uh, with each one I can, drink my coffee black. But now I prefer not to. After, you know, having creamers and stuff there in December and November. So, in that haul, she had <clears throat> this fat-free half and half and the zero sugar French vanilla and she said they don't have this all the time i think they have it in hazelnut too i did get some baby carrots i finally remember to get saya some french fries and he's gonna have that one day with a couple of um, dishes i got some steak fries and y'all we have the oh i need to straighten this because it's getting bad junky i have a video no i haven't did a video on this yet but um i need to do a blog post on it too so the Bojangles, you have to go, I think, in person to get this. But the Bojangles, Bo Famous Seasoning. Bojangles is a chicken place that we have down south that everybody loves. And so we put that on the french fries. And it's this bomb. And it is the bomb. Okay, so I got Fit and Active, 50 calorie. Um, we still have Tropicana in there when everybody was sick. I don't tend to get it when everybody's sick. But lately, I just I was trying to vitamin C it up, y'all. Because I was just coughing up something. Um, she showed this in her haul. The lady that had the WW haul, I got, she's new to me, so I'm not, I don't remember her channel. But anyway, um, I wanted to try that. Then I got some chicken wings because I saw where Aisha cooked some honey barbecue teriyaki something wings for her um, <clears throat> granddaughter and her daughter. So I wanted to try that too. And I only got one bag. Usually I always get two, but you know, it's less of us eating here. So. That's what I did. And then the vanilla bean ice cream. And that's it, y'all, because Sasa asked for that. <sighs> that was a lot of talking. Um, let me put this stuff up. It is 4.56. I should have been cooked. Um, but I had I finally took that tree down. It looks so much more space in here. I'm gonna get rid of some of that. Some a couple of furniture pieces in here. I'm gonna call this place in Raleigh called Green Chair Project so they can get some of my pictures. Um, yeah, you can see. It's a mess right there, but it's just it's just closed. Um, the tree was right there. I didn't show y'all none of that stuff, but you know my season right now is just different. So maybe later on. But I always take pictures, always always take pictures so I can put it on my blog because um, you know that's the way individually as an individual you know is income for myself you know. So all right y'all or for all of us. But y'all know, I hope make our own little coins here and there. And hope needs our coins um, too. So, all right, y'all. And I got to show y'all the kitchen, um, which I already have in my phone when it's clean. So, I'll see y'all in the very next video. 
thank you all that come back um, no matter how long I take an absence. Um, it's a lot of things. I think I just, um, I do keep to myself or internal struggles. Um, not necessarily bad for the Lord. Like I say, the Lord be working on me with different things. Like what to share on my channel, what not to share on my channel. I just want it to be insightful. I want it to be purposeful. And sometimes I get in my head um, too much and I just need to be hope. I don't want it to be just something I'll casual i don't want to be out here trying to do things that doesn't glorify him and um you know and and wasting time wasting time because i see some things that i probably wasted time on years ago but you can't dwell on those things and no uh, you know yeah so i see i got you guys in the next video and um thanks so much for always coming back watching and um bye all right, y'all. I was running my mouth so much that I forgot the meal plan. So, really quick. So, for Monday, this is last week, and I've been doing really good. Um, this little book came from, I think, TJ Maxx, No Marshalls, a couple years ago. I haven't been doing the grocery list side, but I want to keep these to look back on. I have so many different planners and notebooks for meal planning. So, this week on Monday, we have a meatloaf with potatoes. Tomorrow, oh, I forgot the sweet peas. I'll just figure something else out. I have the letter J here, circle, which I didn't do there. And that is Josiah's food. And so on Tuesday, we're having, he will have breakfast. I'll cook him some grits and eggs and hash browns. I got that last week. Some salmon and a salad um, with Jason. We'll probably have um, leftovers or something from some other day because he doesn't really care for salmon like that. But he's been eating salads a lot. So our eating has been different. And we've been eating less and different and trying to be healthier. Um, so chicken patties. Um, Josiah here, chicken patties on bun with Caesar salad. Um, tuna fish sandwiches, a salad. I will have that or Jason will have that um, salad. And my favorite is to have it with pinto beans. <laughs> and I'll doctor up the, their can. But I'll doctor them up. I put like onions and seasonings and garlic and all in it. Just it's so good. So then um, let's see, this is Thursday. Chicken wings and baked beans. So this is probably will be um I'll watch Aisha's video or just throw some barbecue on the chicken wings for Sasa. And then for us, we'll just have air fried chicken wings and usually I just season it with dry seasonings or whatever. I may marinate it if I plan ahead and then just have some garlic green beans and we'll be good to go <clears throat> so then on friday sloppy joe's with steak fries and green beans and then i put here leftovers for us so i'm sure one of these days i'll have leftovers and then saturday um out to eat so i love to go out to eat that's half of my problem but i love to go to like the restaurants and jason and i have really been enjoying going to the mom and pop restaurants um, in our local town or the town over or wherever um, versus going to the franchise places. Now we did go to Chili's the other day. Mm -hmm. And they're consistent. <laughs> Some places you go to, they're consistent. I know with E2M, usually we have like a cheat meal and we usually really look forward to that. But these days we probably still have like a carb or something. So it's like you almost already had your cheat meal. Um, but I'm going to try to, anyway. So um, I also enjoy going out to eat because everybody gathers together. And I have a course on that too, y'all. Uh, we get to talk, sit down, and enjoy company. That's just something that I love to do. I didn't do Sunday yet, and I did the same yesterday. Um, last week, I forgot to do Sunday. Well, I just couldn't think of what to do for Sunday. Um, but anyway, let me get this dinner started, and thanks so much for watching. All right, y'all. Bye.